welcome back to Basic Level Gaming. Uh, for our first video today, we are going to be primarily working in Bastion, um, just on some world quests. Before we go there, though, we are going to jump into the Maw and just finish off some of some daily quests and things like that that show up, um, see what we can get there. Really just working on Venari rep. So that's what we're going to do today. Uh, thank you, and let's go ahead and jump right in and get started. All right, so we are headed back in on our druid here. Um, we're currently in Orbos. Uh, we were setting up for the raid last night, um, but ultimately uh, that just didn't happen. Um, so we won't have that this week, but we'll be back next week with it. Um, in the meantime, we're going to get our world quest set up and all of that good stuff and um, go from there. So let's see what we've got. We also have a time walking dungeon that we need to do at some point. Um, I think I'm going to put in for that maybe this morning here. Um, we'll just kind of see what we've got going on. So let's see back at home we've got some anima and some pants we don't need. Revendreth, we've got some rep, some anima, and some pants we don't need. Um, let's see. Maldraxxus, we've got a necklace that we don't need. It is an upgrade for item level, but I mean, we're trading critical strike for versatility, and I just don't, I don't think that's worth it. Got a little rep there as well. We do still have to do our bastion calling, so that might be where we start out. Plus, it looks like there's three, four, five things of anima there, and none of it ends anytime soon, so we'll be able to get it all in. So that's definitely where we're going to start out. Or do we need to start the maw first, actually, since we're in our boats already? I think we're going to go to the maw first. save us some travel time as long as we remember to use the cipher instead of the hearthstone which apparently is not always the thing we like to do go down here I don't think she'll have any quests for us other than those group ones but we'll check just in case which we need to get those knocked out because I don't think those are weeklies I think those are just one time quests so I'd kind of like to do them Looks like that's everything. So where are our quests today? That one's way out by the Tremaculum, but I don't think we'll go that way because then we have to deal with getting out of there. I think we'll just go over here and do this one first. Is that the Blazing Ingots? Yeah, it is. So it's like literally right over here. This big silver elite that keeps showing up right there. We've seen him a lot lately and I'm not sure. There must be a pattern or something to it that I'm not quite aware of. Because like I said, I've been seeing him a lot. He's not there at the moment. But I've been a part of killing him several times. I don't get anything from him basically. But... We don't still need souls, so I don't think I'll mess with it. Oh, he is here. Or he's about to be here. I'm not going to mess with him. I just... One of the things is I don't like having all of the... Points to the, to, towards the jailer's eye until until I've got the quest done, and then I don't care. But
I guess we'll go kill this one since he's already almost dead. So we need how many more? Two. There's one spawned back up. That'll finish them off. And they don't turn in until you go back to Venari. So you don't get that big old jump in um, Jailer's Eye. Because whenever you complete a quest, it seems to make a massive difference. You know, he's worth a lot. I'm, I'm going to just take him out. Oh, how'd I get out of... Oh, because I changed my talents. I'm like, wait, what is the deal here? stealth unless you kill him, man. There. Alright, now where am I going for this one? I just gotta go way in the back. I think going this way will be the fastest. Yeah, we'll cross this river. I'm sure I'll have to kill him in a moment. And this guy's gonna try to unstealth me. go down here. Oh, nope. 
is over here. I was in the right spot, just wrong path. Oh, it's so well too. Those are done. There's what I'm looking for. for him to go by and then I'll go out and grab those in the middle. There's two right there if I kill those rats. Oh no, there's not. There's only one. But that's okay. Well, I guess I'll pick that soul up on accident.
All right, we're away from that. I don't know. We killed him before, but I don't think I'm gonna mess with him. I think we're just gonna head back. We'll have to buy a new one of those now. Alright, so let's turn this in. Sorry, I was just catching up on my chat from last night. Will that be all, Walker? Still got so much farther to go. Um, I was trying to remember what it is she has that I definitely want. Now that one's obviously going to be a good thing. That one's certainly a good thing. I want that for sure, but I wouldn't want to use it yet. Oh, and that's always good too. So those are all good. So we've got cordial, 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 and that one's appreciative. So we've got these three powers we'll pick up at the next rank. The other one is a little bit further out. That one's appreciative. Oh, that one's cordial too, which we will pick up. So, um, not that I care about it a whole lot, but it's just good to have. Return only if you must. Okay, so that is all we've got here, and we really don't have anything we can do in Torghast other than I'm gonna make another run at Twisted Corridors here um, before too long. Just because I want to see if I can do it now that I've changed things up a little bit. Um, but actually, I'm going to do this real quick while I have rested status. And don't forget, I need to change this stat of this talent. This one is definitely better, but for solo play, I just, I really thrive on having that moonfire to pull and stuff. So. This, I actually don't mind not having. The only thing is, is I pretty much never use this because I have to leap behind them from a distance and I'm always pulling. So I just don't know. I don't know if I'm going to keep that, but for now I'm not going to mess with it. Um, this is kind of nice for the added range. I know it's, I don't know. I know it's something people say is just really important. But for solo play, I am going to switch back over to this. Now, this one's definitely still better. Um, it just helps give you additional healing if you blow it. But I, I don't really hit it, so I don't know. But I never used Mass Entanglement either, so it doesn't really matter. I do miss this, but I do think this is much better. Now, that one I won't touch. I think we'll keep that one on there. I think it helps do a lot more damage. So. Oh, there's the one I was talking about down there. But I've never gotten anything from him, so we're not going to stick around for it. Of course, that'll be the one time he would have dropped it, but, you know. I guess I do need to go by the bank, which is out this way. 
get rid of all these fish. I really need to clean that out because I, I know most of that's not worth anything. I, I do, however, want to take up cooking and stuff at some point. And if I have all the stuff in my bank, I might be able to do it really fast and not have to go find stuff. But I just don't know. It's one of those things where it's easier to throw it in here. Only the finest. And then get it back out. Or, you know, and then get rid of it later than to deal with it now. So. Your patronage is always a I do need to see about organizing an attempt at that key as well before it goes away. We might have to do that this weekend when we can get a little bit more help or whatever. Welcome to the Eternal All right. City. Well, it looks like that's the first one to expire, so I guess we'll go there. Yes. We'll be done with it way before it expires, though. And this one isn't uh, do three quests. When it's got this bar here, you just have to do stuff until it finishes. And it counts if you like loot a treasure on the map, one of the rare treasures, or if you um, go in and kill like a silver elite. Usually, those kind of things still count for it. So that's always good. You know, you can kind of speed up that process a little bit instead of having to do even more world quests. So, and we do have to make sure we go do our tables when we get back into Ardenweald, too. Is there anything? Oh, we got the one for the Maw back, the one that gives Soul Ash and Sigia, which that wouldn't be bad, considering most of these don't do us any good. Some Rep with the Ascended. That's not a bad one to get. I don't. I don't know what I get for the rep, but I do know that I found out you do want all of the reps for Shadowlands. Like, there is stuff for them. So, let's see. I want to go out this side of it, it looks like. So, I think there's an exit right here. Yeah. But, do I want that one? No, I want this one over here. I think. There's a silver elite back there. Bados feeding frenzy. Hmm. Is it up in there? Yeah. Oh, okay. We've done this one before. I know which one this is. This is the one where we have to collect the antlers. The rivalry between Nemia and Pelotus has spanned eons. I am certain they will have a use for you. In the spirit of competition, of course. So we have to kill, like, the little cloud striders, get the antlers. And then we do something with them. I can't remember what. They end up getting posted, like you put them on a stand or something like that.
There's one. Two. Oh, here we go. Oh, do I have to, this is the one that I have to fly through the rings, isn't it? Like, at least somebody's in front of me, because last time I couldn't even find where I was supposed to go. grows stronger for your efforts. All right, now we're to. Let's see, we gotta go out that way. I don't think we're gonna go after that. I don't know how you would get to whatever's out there. Oh, this one's kind of weird. If I remember right, it's like... Oh no, this is the one up on top. There's one that's like in a cave down there somewhere. I guess I have to go back to the person first. I'm surprised I'm just not able to do it right here. will devour everything in their path. Put an end to this threat. What do I have to do? I have to kill stuff, but he was rounding them all up, so...
almost halfway. Luckily, you don't have to get like one per because that would stink. already that's pretty good just need 20 a little more that's it I'm done to do something different. I thought I was done. I'll do it right here. To repel them. Thank you. I guess it didn't matter where I did the rift, I was going back to that top part anyway. Okay, so that's actually all of it here. I was thinking I had to go turn it in somewhere, but it was automatic. So next we need we got up there or down there. There's two down there. If I go up there first, then I can just go there or there and fly down to here. So I guess I'll go up here first. I don't really think I want to go down on that side though, because that's going to dump me into that temple that I don't need to go into. Where the dungeon ent entrance is. Oh, 
There we go. And our buff is about to go away, which is good. Although I'm above 75% health anyway, which is kind of funny. Maybe it's just because it wasn't healed. It was natural regeneration. I don't know. to the left here. And we want to go to the right. I don't know. It's pretty hard in this zone to take shortcuts so I think I'm just going to follow the road because the shortcuts don't always reconnect to stuff so it is wise to practice the art of flying before oh, joining no. the ranks of the ascended let us see how you fare I don't like this one. I don't like any of the flying ones. And this one you have to like leap onto these platforms that propel you and it's not fun. I'm not a, I'm not a I'm not a fan. Didn't work. There are many parts. Which is yours? Oh, they're different each time. And now I don't have the power that I have on there. Never got to see what the power even did. <laughs> Man, so close. 
We are all one under the Archon. Okay, I don't know what that just did. Oh no. I just don't know which one I'm supposed to do. That's so weird. I don't think I had two options last time. Oh, I see. Oh, now I lost it. You only get to use it so many times, I guess. We are all one under the arc. Sure what happened there. Made it. You shall be ready in no time. Alright, but I don't think I can open this chest. If I remember right from last time, you have to have something else. Oh, it's not even there. Oh, there it is. Yeah, it says locked, but it is orange. Does that mean I can do it? No. And they said... Last time I like did this really long path that got me totally lost. So they said we can just do this. And it did work. Alright, so Alright, so let's just head straight back out to that flight path. And we'll fly down to Hero's Rest, I think. It, or no, Aspirant's Rest. I think I need to go over here. No, I guess I am for sure now. I might be too far. No. Ah. <laughs> Stop.
thank you. That is where I wanted to go. I couldn't get out of there. I had to turn off the buff to even land and get help. Alright, we should have flight path straight up ahead. There we go. You seek me. We shine in All right, so that's that one. takes a little while to fly from point to point, unfortunately, but it takes less time than it does to run from point to point. So, so this one is, oh, that one's kind of annoying, but it's all right. I don't know that one. I'm sure we've done it, but I can't think of it. They're both combat ones though. Usually the ones down here are more like just task based. We're going to go around and do this one first. I guess we'll pick this Rising Glory since we're here. This is the one where we get the little bell and have to kill stuff close to the bell. I gift you the power of a lesser chime. Strike back. Let it ring true, so our enemies may see the truth of purity. Come here by the bell.
think we're going to try this. Nope, that didn't do as much as I had hoped. It wasn't too bad though, and it did give a good jump, so. This one go again down out on the bridge. those who have abandoned the path. Its voice is a shrieking terror in their ears. You have taught them well. Alright, so that's that one. So now we got one more to do here in Bastion. We finished our calling already, but we're already we've done so many of them. I'm just gonna go grab the last um anima reward, so it doesn't hurt anything. Sometimes in these, I, well, I've talked about it a hundred times, the elevation messes me up. So, like, I'll think I just need to go one direction, but really I need to go the other direction to where it goes up to the next level of elevation. So, all right. So now we need to go to the 
and it's kind of straight actually. Whoops. <laughs> All right, just want to take a swim. You do your thing. The Forsworn have begun an assault on our Colossus. We have few enough as it is. You must prevent them from claiming it by any means necessary. I'm starting to think I don't actually need to be fighting here. This is take the this core. End quickly. You have forced my hand. Lay this will end weapons. quickly. My task is complete. My task is complete. Hmm. Combat. This will end quickly. It implies I'm just going to pick it up somewhere. So much pride. But I'm not seeing it. I await your instructions. Ah, here it is. I knew it was just picking it up somewhere. Okay, now I kill stuff. I'm gonna go out here and too far away. If you seek your end quickly, I will allow it. Lay down your weapons. Trying to see is that guy elite? No, okay. Then I'll just come right up here and do it. Okay, oh, hey, I got loot from that one.
Almost there. This will end quickly. This will end quickly. That cannot recover. All right, so that is all we have here. We don't have things haven't reset quite yet, um, so we weren't we're going to go. There's certainly nothing in Revendreth that's going to reset that we care about, or Maldraxxus. Um, we're going to have a new uh, calling pop up as well, so we're going to go ahead and hearth back. And we'll probably, yeah, we'll go ahead and end this video uh, once we get back and deposit everything. Um, we got to check out our table, and then we will come back a little bit later when stuff is reset and see what we can do and then um, try and see if we can get into a dungeon as well. And what is it you require? Okay, let's see. Well, let me I'm gonna sell all my junk first so it clears out my bag and I can see what I'm getting. My wares are second to none. All right, the rest is all anima stuff. So let's Until see what we get. Time. Just junk. Always in stock. We got that conduit last time that was a nice upgrade. I mean, it wasn't one we needed, but still. Got quite a bit of anima in there. Um, nothing going on in the conservatory, right? No, we've got one already in five hours. Let's go to the table then.
Not much experience to that one. So we've got some Ascension rep, which is what we're going to start with, obviously. Actually, let's do this one. a lot of anima. Hopefully we finish it. And these guys should be able to take this one. He's the only one hitting that front row for the powers, but that's all right. All right, so that's that. Why is it dark all of a sudden? I don't think I've ever seen it like that. Interesting, it says it's night. I am positive I've never seen that. How's my rep looking with them? Am I getting close to getting my first bonus? Wild Hunt Exalted. Oh yeah, I'm getting close, but I'm not quite there. And then... How are we doing with everybody else? Honored with Court of Harvesters. Court of Night is only friendly. Honored with the Ascended. The Undying Army we've revered. We've done quite a bit in um, Maldraxxus, which is that one, so... Um, and then, of course, we don't have any rep for the old stuff, which I do need to go back and work on unlocking um, some of the, well, all of them, uh, ultimately, the un uh, the allied races, just to have them unlocked in case we want to play one. So, oh, you know what? We didn't go to the mushroom. Let's check that real quick, because it will reset in, like, 20 minutes if it's not. If we haven't done it already. I think we might have done it yesterday. Yeah. Yeah, we did. So, we're good. Alright. Um, so, that's going to be it for this video. We will be back a little bit later. Alright. So, there you have it. Uh, primarily, just kind of trekking along with our daily maintenance stuff that we've got to do. Um, getting our daily rep for Venari. Uh, trying to work that up to get those final Torghast powers. Um... And then the Bastion quests, you know, ultimately just the best rewards we could get uh, for the moment were there. Uh, so that's what we knocked those out. And we're just going to keep trekking along there. Uh, we are going to keep working on the Layer 8 in uh, Torghast. Uh, so as we see them, we will work on those. Uh, but that's what we got for this video. Uh, we will be posting a second video here just in a little bit. So thank you and have a great day.